Yo, what is up, YouTube and the Monster Club? It is yours truly, the life of the party, the young Gohart and the king of the Labor Day scene because I am the party monster. I'm back out with a brand new video, and as you guys can tell, we're back in the kitchen of Monster. So here's the deal. I'm going to be 100% honest and transparent with you guys. So up until about October 7th, a lot of the videos you guys are going to be seeing up until then are like videos that I've already filmed priorly and everything and videos that I knew you guys would enjoy. But unfortunately, this kind of nature of the beast always being busy and everything, just always on the go that sometimes I don't even have time to post the videos that I want to exactly when I want to post it, which yes, sucks for the inner analytics and everything but just know that your boy is always constantly working for you guys and just building bigger and better things for you guys so this is actually a newer video but just know that the reboot is coming october 7th we are going to be in the room of monster going forward i'm actually probably going to be giving you guys a little behind the scenes look at the room of monster it's getting 100 percent where it needs to be like i'm excited about it honestly because it's looking good and everything. You guys are going to be seeing some things in the new room and everything. So I'm really stoked for that one. And uh, yes, more exciting news. We're actually really close to 500 subscribers. We're actually 38 subscribers away from 500, which blows my mind as I'm sitting here thinking about it right now. But we are so close. This channel has come so far from day one. And for those that don't know, I've actually had two previous versions of the sneaker channel and everything and lost them just due to losing the phone and whole lot of issues other than that but this one being where it has been the last four years is insane to me and it just means the world to me that you guys have been rocking with me hardcore like that and everything so to get to 500 would mean the world to me and we're gonna get there i promise you and i got some special things planned when we get there so Stay tuned. Okay, guys. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys my most recent pickups from like the last week and a half or so. Basically, these pickups came from either going to rave events, J. Crew, or just sneaker shopping at Playlist Closet or the mall or whatever. But before we do all that, you already know what time it is. We're going to take a toast to the Monster Club. And I promise you guys, I'm actually going to be cutting down on all my drinking this month and everything. I'm still going to be drinking because that's what I do. I'm the party monster. But I'm not going to be drinking as hard as I normally do because... For those that don't know, bro, as much drinking as you guys see me drink on this channel, I do like 10 times more off camera. So yeah, I need to definitely take a step back, get myself healthy again, and get back in that gym and just kind of work on me for a little bit and everything. But again, the drinking won't stop because that's not in my DNA. I, I like drinking. So we got some honey on deck and apparently this cup comes from a restaurant i never heard of and i came to the word on camera because i'd get demonetized but just know that yeah it's a thing here's the last of the hitty so starting things off i'm gonna show you guys my most recent like jersey pickups i actually went to two raves over the weekend the first one was friday i actually went to the um crank that show and Baltimore it was a fun time and everything I had a really good time got there kind of late wish I would have gotten there way earlier but your boy had to make some money so it is what it is but I actually got this sick jersey right here again I'm definitely going to be the jersey collector apparently in 2023 or 2024 it is a lazy jersey check it out I like this colorway and everything you got the blue black and white going on right here you got lazy and it's definitely stitched in, so definitely good on the quality. Got L on one side, got L on the other, and what really? No, we got a. Wait a minute, what, do you, what do you have on the other side? A twenty, a twenty-four on the other side for I guess twenty twenty-four. But on the back, this is what really sold me the back of it. This is just insane. You got lazy, and you got her on the electric chair. Boom, this thing is sick. I like the whole, like, attention to details. You got, like, the spark lines and a lightning and whatnot. This is definitely look really hard with, like, some military fours or something like that. Or some, I don't know, you can do a lot with this one. Or some powder blue. Just any black, well, any blue and white Jordan, honestly. And she's apparently a local artist, so shout out to her from being from... The great state of Baltimore, or well, the great state of Maryland, the city of Baltimore. But next up, next concert I actually went to was the Marshmallow concert. So I got this shirt. 
The 2XL, which normally I don't like getting a 2XL. I'm more of an XL large kind of guy or a large. But they actually ran out of XL, so I, I kind of got stuck with the, the, the 2XL. So I'm going to make it work. I'm going to put on some more muscles. So it is what it is. And you guys are going to be seeing the Marshall video really soon. I think you guys are going to be enjoying that. And there was like a little bit of surprise at the end of the video. So definitely stay tuned for that once they lock Okay, in. you guys know what? I'm going to sweeten the deal. We get a 38 subscribers besides doing a pizza party. Very special 500 subscriber unboxing, which I've been saving for you guys for like the last three years. I'm also going to be doing another shoot away on that pizza party. We're going to be doing it live and everything. You guys going to be rocking with me. We're going to be drinking. We're having a good time and everything. Getting more handy for me. Again. I am well aware more than 38 of you guys will watch this video, so if you haven't already subscribed, subscribe. If not, share with a friend, and let's hit that 500 subscriber goal this week. I, I'm definitely challenging you guys. Hell, I'll do double or nothing. I'm posting this video on, let's say, Wednesday. If it hits 500 subscribers by next Wednesday, I'm going to double that odds. I'm actually going to be doing two super ways, as opposed to just the one for reaching the 500, so... Boom, I can make it happen for you guys. If you just rock with me, I will rock with you guys. And this is a little bit of a bonus because I'm actually going to be showing you guys all my pickups from J. Crew. Your boy got really lucky and had really good customer service. So your boy got 150 in free clothes. So your boy went all in and everything. But anyway, I actually got this pickup from Adidas. And I forgot to mention it in another video. So here it is now. My new Arsenal jersey. Boom, check it out. Check it out. This is the Away jersey. I rock with it. Check it out. Someone actually returned it, so I bought it. It was like a size large, so mine's now. But anyway, let me show you guys some of my pickups from, well, my last week's edition of pickups from J. Crew. Start off with these bobber socks that I kind of forgot I even picked up, but here they are. I have been fishing before, but I don't know what made me really like them. Maybe because I thought I was going to be getting them way cheaper than I ended up getting them for, but they were free, so it is what it is. You got the American flag socks, which sure rocks for Labor Day, but it is what it is. And this one, I feel like a little bit guilty. I feel like this was my mind because y'all know I love drinking. I love my job. So they kind of married the two things together. And I got this I love beer shirt, which is so weird for a job that I work at, but whatever. Especially being the kind of story it is, but. I don't know, they, they, they made it, so I bought it, so they can't get mad at me for wearing a shirt that they sell. Last that we got, well, I think I, I don't know if I showed you guys these, but we got some white shorts. I don't know, I'm all about white shorts and white clothes nowadays, so I kind of wanted to switch it up a little bit. Next up, we have the 7 inch, I want to say performance. Tech, tech pants, tech pants, or tech shorts, or tech shorts, like a cream colorway. And last up, we got the slim fit chino pants, all white. You know, you've always bring it this year. You know, he's trying you know, to put that clean, fresh look and everything. So here they are. Boom. Besides the um, chino shorts, all free. I think I paid like eleven dollars for those. So. It is what it is. Okay, guys. So, it's the next thing. I kind of forgot to edit this in. I was just super tired and everything. So, I'm going to show you guys my pickups from Hot Topic because there were a couple of pickups from there. So, I thought, why not just film in the video real quick. First up, I'm going to show you the last thing I actually picked up. The store is actually going out of business. So, everything was like 50% off. And I'm a huge fan of this character in this um, TV series. So, boom. I got the My Hero Academia Bakugo Energy Drink, which... I don't know, it should be really explosive. Actually, my favorite character, so of course I had to pick that up. You already know, I'm, I'm a Bakugo guy, so it is what it is. But I also got a couple of shirts as well, and everything was 50% off, so that was really cool. We got this Spring Trap shirt, Five Nights at Freddy's, you already know what it is. Size large, half off, and we got another pickup. And if you guys couldn't tell already, I'm a huge fan of Five Nights at Freddy's, so... Next pickup should be no surprise is actually the shirt from the movie itself. 
Five Nights at Freddy's. We got my favorite in the background, Foxy. Boom, check it out. That is super sick. I definitely need that poster and everything. But yes, all my Hot Topic pickups. Okay, guys, so let's finish the rest of this any. Oh, um, let me just re clarify what I just said in case it didn't come out the way I thought it would originally. I'm actually going to be doing this. King Ken, he's getting his shoes this week. I know I have mentioned that he had won the contest prior. He did win. He's going to get his shoes this week. That's that's one shoe taken care of. But there's also another shoe that I have to give away for you guys anyway. But I'm thinking, you know what? You guys reached 5 subscribers by Wednesday of next week. So, again, you guys have a 7 whole day run to make this happen. I'm going to be doing a double shoe giveaway. So... Instead of just giving away two shoes, and we actually giving away three shoes, and yeah, it should be a fun time. So again, challenge your ball. All you guys hit it literally hit the subscribe button. It's not that hard. Like you guys are on the damn threshold of 500. It's not like we're here. But anyway, let me show you guys the shoes that I picked up from Playboy's Closet. Originally, I was looking for another shoe that day, and I said, you know, if I see it, I'm gonna buy it. And slight spoiler, I found it. But I'm gonna show you guys that one last. But you know, let's get into the shoes I picked up from Playdos. Start off with these right here. We got some mellows. Not from here. These are the reverse toxics. And grant, I knew nothing about the mellow ball shoes at all, but I thought they were like this really sick and everything. And as you guys can see, these are actually dead stock. Check it out, check it out. Got these for Sixty dollars originally. I think these retail for like one ten or one twenty, something along those lines, and they're a size ten. And yeah, these look really crazy, but I really rock with that. Like I like having things that just kind of don't make any sense sometimes. If that makes any sense to y'all, like I like things that just look really out there. So that's why I picked them up. And it was a last minute purchase too. Like I originally was not gonna get these, but next up, they actually have. Not a, a pick, a shoe pickup, but we got a jacket I actually purchased. This bad one right here. It's got a, it's a varsity jacket. You got LA. You got L on one side. You got L in the Lakers logo on the other. On the sleeve, you got Lakers. On the other sleeve, you have absolutely nothing, but on the back, you have Lakers again. Boom, check it out. Super clean. I'm a Lakers fan. Well, I'm a LeBron fan. Let's just put it out there like that. So this on for the rest of the video. This is actually a brand new. I got this for $50. I don't know what it retails for. Honestly, I don't really care. I think it's a cool jacket, so I went with it. But next up, let me show you the other shoe I have. You guys see the chrome box. It is shiny right now. Look at that. Boom, look at that thumbnail. And this hat is J. Crew for those that are curious. It is actually the Jordan 6 Chrome. Check them out. They actually came out in 2002. Got them for $125, but a little bit less actually because I had a 25% coupon for them. Check it out. Check it out. These are like super clean on the bottom. They are not dead stock by any means, but I, know, I thought they were cool and everything. And they got the lace locks on both shoes. So. Um, they were size nine and a half, which really sold me on them because I'm a size nine and a half. And I don't know. I'm like I'm not sure I'm gonna break these out, but they're coming soon. Just now. But the big pickup of the day. When I said if I saw these, I'd buy them. And unfortunately I found them. You know, you don't even know what shoe it is. The Jordan Flights. They just came out last week. They are, of course, the Breaking Bad Boys. Let's give them the love they deserve. The Air Jordan 4 and the White Thunder colorway. These are crazy. I know people are kind of hit or miss on them on the YouTube market and everything, but I love them. That's why I picked them up at the end of the day. I know I should not be buying shoes right now, especially in my room getting to where it's is trying to get to but uh, I just fell in love with these shoes and I saw them at sneaker con and I was like I gotta have these so boom here they are check them out check them out this is you guys first look at these they will be getting a full in-depth review and on foot I actually got these wow this is okay so this is kind of funny 
I just noticed they actually gave me the display version of the, the one shoe, so I still got like the whole like little shoe standing thing and whatnot. Got it for retail and everything. And overall, just first initial thoughts, the quality on the suede is pretty good. I know it's a GR shoe and there's so many of them out there, but I think I got a really good pair, so I'm not mad at all. Oh, these were actually literally the last pair of men's in the store I that I got and everything. So I was like, you know what? It, it was meant to be because if it had something crazy like an 11 or like a size eight and a half, they would have stayed in the store where they are. But a 10, and a, a 10 I can work with. I'm a nine and a half, a 10, it, it's fine for me. Like we'll, we'll make it work and everything. And literally the moment I bought these, someone then bought the other pair they had, like they had two pairs left. They had one kids and one man's. So I got the last man. Someone just got the last kids, the last moment. So uh, I think it was just meant to be, I guess, and everything. So here they are. And yes, that's going to do it for this video. But if you enjoyed it, hit that like button. Share it with a friend. Let's get this party started and everything. Let everyone know that the party monster is here. And I'm here to stay. I got a ton of heat on the way for you guys. Like I'm not trying to throw bars, but that was some bars. But anyway... You enjoyed it share with a friend hit the like button hit that subscribe button more importantly and as always you guys can follow me on instagram at party monster 05 and on x at party monster one but until then remember this very important rule to life if you forget nothing i've said then don't forget this don't be a dick be excellent to each other party on dudes peace i love all y'all bye